I'm Chad Bocoon. I'm from Grand Island, Nebraska originally. I am an internal medicine doctor. I've done all my training here at the University of Nebraska Medical Center. I did medical school, residency. I was a chief resident uh, through our VA hospital, and then I've been on, on faculty here for eight years. I chose internal medicine because of the diversity of patients. We really run the gamut of all adult illnesses, and in the specific uh, type of job that I'm in as a hospital doctor, I see those as acute illnesses. I've actually always wanted to be a doctor. My mom tells me back to even when I was a small child and my grandmother when I was five gave me a book of old medical terms from like the 1920s. So I really kind of chased and followed a, a dream I think I had. I have no physicians in my family except my wife and uh, I've always enjoyed the sciences enjoyed uh, seeing people get better and uh, have always kind of traced, chased the dream of being a doctor. The teachers that trained me here at UNMC really made me the type of physician I was and I knew very early that I was going to stay in academics in some way or another. I enjoy my job even more than when I started because I get challenged by very, very bright young learners every day and that challenge of staying on top of things, being at the, at the forefront of medicine but then also seeing them sort of have the light turn on and seeing them uh, really get it has been what drives my passion to continue to teach. And I wouldn't really work anywhere else but at an academic medical center. As a hospital-based doctor, when I first sit down with a patient, oftentimes they are very ill. And to be able to sit down with them, look them in the eye, maybe grab their hand and tell them that, you know, you're at a very big place, sometimes as big as their hometown often, but we're here one-on-one, -on -one. it's gonna be you and I, or my team and I that are gonna be taking care of you, help them move through the process, help them see their way through consultants and different people who are gonna come see them and to help them get better. That reassurance, that first point of contact, I think is critical to making a bond with a patient and helping them get better.